Are you a leader in the workplace? Do you want to motivate your team? Well, guess what? You, you can't motivate anyone, but you can create the conditions within which people's self-motivation breaks through. The tiniest change in circumstance can have big impacts on people's behavior. By unleashing the secrets of the brain in the workplace, you'll be able to develop an engaged and high-performance workforce. After 25 years as a trainer and manager helping leaders to help themselves, I've written The Brain-Based Boss to help all leaders, from those who work at the coalface to those at senior management level, to achieve those objectives. Based on five proven principles of brain science, The Brain-Based Boss is a book of practical, workplace-ready tools for leaders who want to motivate their staff to motivate themselves and to contribute to their own personal and professional success. Written in a user-friendly and engaging style, The Brain-Based Boss aims to teach leaders how to encourage their staff to exhibit greater self-discipline, develop a growth-oriented mindset and a goal-focused approach to their work, and to spend a greater proportion of their working day in the optimal productivity state of flow. Actively engaged employees choose to do more than they have to. Unengaged employees only do what they have to, they show up, they're present. Disengaged employees are seeking work elsewhere, appropriating or even sabotaging resources and they're bad-mouthing you to others. What percentage of employees, on average, do you think are in each category? Now it varies from time to time and place to place and industry to industry, but some good proportions to go by. Engaged employees, 26%. Present, 46%. Disengaged, 28%. Ouch. But does it matter? A 15% increase in engagement correlates to a 2.2% increase in operating margins. Higher engagement means lower staff turnover, lower absenteeism, higher customer satisfaction, better safety records, higher quality and more efficient productivity, even less staff theft. So yes, it does matter. A 10% increase in engagement can lead to an average increase in earnings of $12,130 per employee. So you do your own maths. So what are some of the tools in the book, The Brain-Based Boss, and its associated subscriber video series? We can learn how to exhibit greater self-discipline and perseverance, the top two factors that contribute to personal and professional success. You can take a more effective approach to making decisions resulting in better long-term choices with, with less regrets. You can develop a workplace culture that will support your leadership when you can't physically be there. And you can deliver feedback in the most useful way that people are more willing to hear and to act upon. You can challenge assumptions and prejudices to break down obstacles and objections to change in your workplace. And you can deal directly and proactively with people you might previously have considered to be difficult, and so many more. For the book The Brain-Based Boss and the associated subscriber video series, go to brainbasedboss.com.